You know, I was sitting there recording songs and poems that I've heard or read, and that's just something I do most every day. And I, well, I got to thinking, I've, I've never ever written a letter to my grandson. Oh, Hayden, by the time you hear this, well, you're already a big boy. I remember when you were growing up, you always worried you weren't going to be tall. Well, quite obvious that has come true. And you know that there's a lot of things about you. You're funny and wise and you're sensitive and you're interesting and a real ball of fire. Oh, your parents are all of those things. You know, I know you're going to be strong and you've got a wonderful girlfriend and I bet she's a good hugger. You see, your father and mother, well, they always were good huggers. Oh, I wish you happy days. Oh, you're going to have some bad days too, eh? But you see, they're, well, they're as important as most of them, so... Well, it's so you can appreciate the good ones. And uh, there's going to be some disappointments. And I know, well, you'll be able to handle them. You see, Grandma always says life is 10% of what happens and 90% how you handle it. And I pray that uh, you learn humility. And please, I always let an outsider feel inside and will always be kind. And I hope you learn that honesty is the best policy. And that doing a hard day's work, well, it will always make you feel better. And be a loyal friend, you know, one that people can count on and trust. And I hope you put all of these wonderful things that you possess to work and to, well, to make yourself and the world around you a better place to live in. And please learn about the God stuff. You know, it really works is to trust your grandpa. Oh, you have such a wonderful mother and father. And they're going to be the ones that, well, they taught you all the good things in life. So just remember how to play and well, you're in for a loving time. You know, I hope it will always be close. A lot of times I can't wait to see you. Just remember, Grandpa loves you.